and welcome to Glasgow Science Centre at home. My name is Holly and today we'll be learning about one of the most promising methods for energy production, nuclear fission. Nuclear fission is a splitting of heavy atomic nuclei into smaller ones. The fuel used in nuclear power plants is uranium. The uranium nucleus contains lots of protons and neutrons which are held together in a sphere. To initiate fission, neutrons are released towards the uranium fuel. The nuclei then absorb these neutrons and become excited, changing shape from a sphere into a more teardrop-like shape. This change in shape causes the nucleus to split apart into two smaller nuclei, releasing a lot of energy and more neutrons. Because every uranium nucleus releases neutrons after fission, more and more nuclei undergo fission in what's known as a chain reaction. The chain reaction will continue until we run out of uranium fuel. Here we have our nuclear reactor with our uranium mousetraps and neutron ping pong balls. When I release the neutron into the reactor, it will collide with the uranium, releasing more neutrons and so on and so forth until we run out of fuel. Are you ready? Three, two, one! Oh, that was a cool neutron! Not enough kinetic energy in that neutron to ignite fission. Alright, we've got another neutron. We're going to inject this with a bit more energy. Three, two, one! the energy released during nuclear fission is heat. In a nuclear power plant shown here, the released heat energy is used to convert water into steam. The expansion of the steam causes a build-up of pressure, which spins a turbine round and round. The turbine then rotates a generator, which produces electricity that we can use to power our homes. Thanks for listening and make sure to check out all our other Glasgow Science Centre related content. And let us know what you'd like to see next. See you later!